Hey guys, and welcome back to some more Hypixel Skyblock. Two big things today, okay, man. First off, I'm using a different texture pack. It's actually miraculous, but it's winter season, baby. I'm so happy to see Snowfall back up in here, even though the leather armor isn't quite as cool as with my texture pack. I'll give it a pass. I'm feeling very festive, okay? We have snow over here in the UK. I can't remember the last time it snowed in November, man. It's sick. Also, the second thing, we're doing something that isn't Diana, Dungeons, or Enderman Slayer. We're actually doing something totally new today. Your boy is finally finishing off the last few skyblock achievements that i need so right now we have 77 percent of the achievements which is pretty impressive i've never actually really gone for them this is just what i've gotten through playing the game at the current state for the time being we're going for the challenge achievements a few of these are ones that have been patched into the game after i already did the thing so despite the fact that i literally have video evidence of me buying the golden dragon pet from the npc i don't have the achievement how to train your dragon and i don't have the achievement for buying the golden dragon from the NPC itself. That's going to be painful. 500 million coins down the drain. I forgot to shout this out last stream. Thank you, Vedran, for the 300 millers. I haven't claimed my auctions till now just so you could get your moment in the spotlight. And with this trade, we should be back over 10 billers, baby. I mean, this is all until I buy the golden dragon egg for the second time. Thank you for the 148 mil, though, Rex. In true refraction fashion, we are absolutely winging this. I have no plan whatsoever. All I know is that I'm going to leave the secret achievements till last because some of those are pain. So we got to find Don Espresso with some tasty mithro. I already haven't got a clue what that one is. I'm pretty sure that's probably a Dwarven Mines NPC. There are so many of those, including one where you literally have to talk to somebody for seven hours. So stay tuned for seven hours of right clicking, guys. We got a fish using the farmer's rod. Easy enough. Place fire. Oh, man. The amount of roof forest things I've placed on my island right now. Why have you got to do this to me? And power a beacon of any kind. So we don't even have to move off of our island for that first one. Because I can just go buy some fuel for this thing. And hopefully that gives me the achievement. Because I've fueled this thing many a time. And it's never given me an achievement. So let's just whack a whole other stack in there. And there we go. Beaconator 2.0. You love to see it, boy. Golden Dragon Lobby. Someone's already found a Golden Dragon Lobby? Really? Relock? Oh my god, I actually hear him. Real luck, my boy. You are about to make yourself a cool 50 million coins. This is sick to get straight off the bat. Thank you. I mean, I'm not too gassed about spending 500 million coins on this pretty underwhelming pet once again. But for the achievement, for the content, we'll do it. How to train your dragon. There we go. Right, where is my guy? Where's my guy? I was about to say, if it's him, if it's him, you're giving me 50 million coins, sir. Definitely not the other way around. 500 million coins and one of every perfect gem and 50 enchanted gold blocks. You know me and my skyblock coins i pretty much value them more than real world coins at this point but there we go the dragon's egg and this is what i have to stare at while i'm doing it i'm a broken man even more money down the drain thank you my guy i'm very grateful 50 millers for you today extracts a heavy toll chat speaking of today extracting a heavy toll that leads us perfectly into the next achievement which is actually to put all five perfect gemstones on the gemstone gauntlet would you believe you see my perfect gemstone gauntlet right here hopefully just going in here unequipping one and then putting it back on should give me the achievement there we go i call that mercy oh if that popped up the first time i did it before everyone even knew it turned gold and stuff that would have been sick but we love retcons chat next couple should be pretty easy i need to go get a farmer's rod and i need to kill a squid with a ink wand collection fishing clay farmer's rod recipe there we go chance to fish up farm animals this is such a weird fishing rod dudes and we just got a fish here because there's an increased chance for squids right kill two birds with one stone fish using the farmer's rod i don't even need to catch anything what a lame achievement and we get a squid straight away and boom infinite darkness two for the price of one baby look at that efficiency let's see what we need to get next I haven't even got the first page yet place five unique islands i know one of those is the pond island and that's a separate achievement oh my corpse gonna hate me after this so there's two unique islands there's three unique islands oh this is so ugly there's four unique islands and there's five unique islands we got both of them who was saying it's bug chat easy clap time to start fishing and arcadia now we only got to feed don espresso right so if you guys can let me know when there's an event for that in the uh dwarven mines or the crystal hollows or whatever i would very much appreciate it uh kill 
Yo, this game's trying to turn me into Anakin Skywalker, bro. What's going on? Haven't you got to find the little, like, shop? Isn't that where they spawn? Do you even voodoo? That one is easy. Consume 200 magma creams and kill a ghost. Get out of here. Thank you. Do you even voodoo? I like how I have the voodoo doll, but I've never got that achievement because the only time I ever used it was for that bug that let you stack, like, billions of damage with Archer. <laughs> All right, so now you need to buy 200 magma creams and basically just bow spam. Flaming hot. Oh, I've got that already. Oh, all right. Now I think it's time to kill a youngling. Let's go beat up a child. Oh, this feels so wrong. Oh, no, man. You know what? I'm god potted up. I got to make this as swift as possible, bro. Slaying with the golden dragon as well. Oh... I definitely did mean to. Nah, this, this game corrupts people, man. Closer to the dark side now. My eyes better start turning yellow, bro. Out of here, Ghostbuster, easy enough. This is already looking clean, you know. This page is looking a bit sorry for itself, though. Give Fetcher the item he asks for. Wear a set of growth armor. Find a dark monolith. Oh, so we're in a good place for these achievements. We got to get the goblin raid event. We can do both of these things while we're here. We can go speak to Fetcher. We can wear the growth armor while we're here. And we can try and find the dark monolith. That's basically the dragon egg that spawns around here, right? I don't know all of the spawn locations for the dark monolith, but I do know a few. So we'll check a few locations and uh, hopefully... Oh my god. The one time I actually don't really need good RNG, my luck is like that, and I can't drop a judgment core? What is wrong with this game? What is wrong with this game? I actually hate it. Nice RNG pencil. Was this your doing? I've never had luck like that in this game. Never. Pretty sus, bro. All right, chest plate, leggings, helmets. Easy clap. Why has it taken me so long to get this achievement? This achievement's literally been in the game since day one, and growth armor actually used to be pretty drippy. So now I gotta get the, the achievements that I was too tight to get back in the day. When everyone was first getting their alchemy, using enchanted sugarcane to make speed potions, I was too afraid to make speedster armor or the speed artifact again to get these achievements because I was a proper tight one. Now look at me, filling my inventory like I just don't care, man. Oh, I don't have the space for this. I think I bought far too much sugar cane that was 77 mil yeah i'm gonna be honest i know the speed artifact used to be expensive back in the day but i don't think it was that expensive so yeah you only need one stack oh that's actually so sad hello fetcher hi i need your help maybe i'm looking for some stuff don't remember the name tbh it's hot and gives energy i need one plus one cheap coffee there you go, Fetcher. Helpful hand. We need to forge a perfect gemstone. Okay, we can't get that one done this stream, but we can start it at least. We gotta find a fairy grotto and we gotta drink a burning potion. Dude, the amount of achievements in the crystal hollows and the dwarven mines is actually stupid. There's so many. Oh, I have a topaz crystal. All right, sweet. Yeah, that works. Warp forge. We need five flawless topaz, refine ore, and perfect topaz gemstone. Confirm. I don't have the required items. What? Oh, I've placed it. Oh, I need to go pick it up. All right, let's get my crystal back. Thank you. And while we're here, fairy grotto. There we go. Magical place. It is a pretty magical place, right? Wait, have I just accidentally walked into a uh, Corleone spawn? I actually need the achievement for killing Corleone. What are the chances? Bro, what is with my RNG? What is actually with my RNG right now? I am actually getting so lucky with these achievements. It's insane. <laughs> What the heck? We're going to make a burning potion and a saving grace, right? Before we do that, let's just go in here. Refine ore, topaz gemstone. Easy, bro. Can't get that one this stream, but at least we've set the wheels in motion. You know what I mean? Now it's time to bust it over to the desert once again. Bro, it's so cool, like, having to do this to, like, explore all the islands and stuff. I haven't done this in so long. Speaking of, though, I actually don't know what kind of fantasy world we're living in right now, but Hypixel Skyblot's next update is literally a Pigacle video. Have you guys seen Jay of Armand's tweet? He's on about bingo, bro. He's gonna have bingo. You create a new profile and you'll have bingo challenges to do things on a certain new profile that will unlock tokens in a special shop on your main profile. So the next update is literally just recycling the early game content and stealing from a Pigacle video. <laughs> I mean, it should be pretty interesting. It'll be something to do, I guess, and an excuse to have a second profile. I hope the shop rewards are pretty interesting and pretty cool. But yeah, it's a pretty strange update. If the shop is cool, I'm happy with it, man. Right, burning potion. Drink that 
that thing up and no enchants needed. We're almost on the secret achievements. I don't think all of them are that bad. Oh, wait, we are pretty much on them. Consume the saving grace. I wonder how that works if you have a booster cookie on. I've literally never made a saving grace, by the way, chat. I'm pretty sure it was glitched for the longest time. I don't know if it still is. It very well could be. But yeah, I wonder what it's like with a booster cookie on. We'll find out, shall we? Yeet second chance all right it used it anyway i feel so scammed why does it use it if you have a booster cookie on <laughs> what at least it works though i guess but what like if i wanted to run around with a saving grace in my inventory just in case my cookie buff ran out i'd be pretty annoyed if i died and it used my saving grace i can't lie but at least that thing costs like 50k coins to craft or something how much are cookies nowadays anyway Ooh. Yeah, this is why you all need to get on store.hypixel.net and use code REFRACTION, man. You would make rocks, baby. You know, I'm just buying inventory full. I'm getting dangerously close to not having uh, a cookie buff, and I'm not about that. Why are you giving me three blaze pets? Huh? Oh, he says craft keep? Oh, thank you, bro. He just wants me to keep him. My guy. This is exciting, bro. I actually have an excuse to wear my superior dragon armor. Come to papa. We need our blaze pet on. We'll use the blaze to make the blaze. Then we go to the blazing fortress and every single one of these will be epic. One, two, three. An actual lucky stream? That's respectable. You know what? I'm going to auction the, uh, the epics and I'm going to keep the legendary one in memory of this moment. I've crafted so many blaze pets on these streams. Do you all remember when I literally used to do this countless times per stream and I never got a legendary one? This is mad. I'm going to keep that next to my Phoenix, actually. That's how much of a special moment. Actually, it's not quite on the level of the Phoenix. You don't quite get to be in the same space. Socially distanced, but that is a special moment. Let's carry on with the actual theme of the stream. All right, we're on the secret achievements. I had to write these ones down and figure out which ones I had and hadn't gotten. So most of what I actually need is in the dwarven mines i need the nightmare achievement which is a secret quest from an npc i need the cult of the fallen star and i need the ring i don't know if i want to do those ones yet i think we're gonna start things off with defeating death i've done this before but it must have been before it was an achievement all we have to do is kill a death mite. Okay, so now all I need is my left click mage setup. Got my golden dragon. How much damage do we do? 27 million. Nice weapon. Ah, I'm using Hyperion. Yeah, this does a little bit more damage. I can't lie. <laughs> And out of here. Thank you. Defeating death. Slayer death, mate. Which one do I go for next? Shrimp? Now, we'll start off with the Bednum quest chat. Because by the time I've started that quest, we should be able to go to the Cult of the Fallen Star. And then we'll go do the Shrimp quest while we wait for three Skyblock days to progress. That's actually some efficient speed running right there. I like that. There's my guy. What's up, Bednum? I just had a very, very strange dream. In my dream, I flew out of my body and I went through some kind of screen barrier. I turned and I could see myself standing behind that screen right here. Around me were strange objects everywhere, but the strangest part was the giant. A giant sitting in front of that screen watching me. The giant seemed to speak a foreign language. They screamed poggers. And then I woke up in sweat. I'm really upside down. I need time to think. Thanks for listening. So we started that quest at least. So now we'll go to the end. It's time to find ourselves shrimp the fish, baby. This thing best not be too rare or I will cry. We just need to find shiny blocks down here and eventually one of them will give me shrimp the fish. You're not gonna get it? I mean, never say never. It's been a lucky stream so far we'll get the magic find on because why not oh oh my god that's great yo shrimp there's no way i just got that second try youtube shock thumbnail face moment since all we have is time to burn i'm gonna grab myself a rose and we're busting it over to the park baby because now we have to do one of the stupidest achievements that to be honest they only really topped with the eight hour conversation in the dwarven mines which is oh i don't even need a flower we just need to right click on this flower for five whole minutes man look at you so flexing his very sexy exotic and stable dragon armor you need to left and right click i need to do both i'll try holding a flare in my hand as well see if that works death streaks why have you only just told me this i'm actually seeing different colors now my hands are actually starting to cramp up now. But hey, we're seeing different colors and stuff. This is a good sign. You have the wrong flower. I'm giving up. Ow! I, can I sue for damage to my body? Right, we're gonna go back and talk with Bednam or whatever his name is. All right, have you got more dialogue for me, my guy? I wonder if I'll have that nightmare again tonight. Maybe I should come back when it's nighttime and speak with him. For the time being, though, let's see what else we can work on. Sirit. 
Never mind, we're doing this achievement last. Melt to death in the magma fields. Wash off the king's scent using water. I didn't even know you could do that. Wear a full set of farm armor. Give a thousand total gifts. Craft a greater backpack. Complete the end race in under 42 seconds and find a golden goblin. All right, we're going to start off with the, uh, the end race, I think. This should be super easy, right? I have not done the end race in so long, though, that I can't exactly remember where it goes to. But at least the aspect of the void makes it a lot easier. Either way, I scuffed that, but there's no way that's more than 42 seconds. That's what I thought, game. I need to craft a greater backpack. This is a scam because I've crafted more of these than any man should ever craft. Greater backpack, thank you. Storage forever indeed. Well, it used to be when you could carry around infinite of these things, but those days are long gone. I need to burn in the magma fields and find the king. Let's go down here. I've never been so excited about burning to death. Should have stayed cool. Let's go. Wait, Bednam. This is perfect timing. Hello, my good man. What are you saying? I had another nightmare very similar to the previous one. I could see myself behind the screen again it looked like i was talking i couldn't hear it but the words appeared on the screen the exact words i told you last time so weird so weird i need time to think all right so i guess we come back to him in the morning farm armor yes that's what we need let's get it on get the achievement and be gone oh it looks very similar to my superior i don't want to throw my superior out there we go and be gone you know what? we're actually blitzing through these we've gone from 77 percent to 90 percent wash off the king's scent we need to get a golden goblin we need to kill a pig using the pigman sword and we need to buy a pet from a ringo so we can't do that one all right so you can buy goblin eggs off the bazaar now right let's just buy a stack i guess if i don't get a go golden goblin from a stack of these i'll be very upset there we go okay kill pig with pigman sword i think i have a max set pigman sword in my museum i've had to slaughter so many innocent things for these achievements they don't deserve of it you know how many pigs i had to murder to create this sword this is fair it really isn't i'm pretty sure techno did the math how many pigs had to die just to create the pigman sword and the game's not happy one more i should have just killed a youngling with the pigman sword 1.2 million pigs died now i'm into the achievements that i am very 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 unhappy about i need to give things away which i guess is in fitting with christmas and do the aspect of the jerry i guess we'll start off with the gifts we need to buy a thousand white gifts right we got to go into hub seven you already know hub seven is the wave come into hub seven if you want free stuff oh this is going so very wrong festive altruist five there we go i got a tiered achievement getting things we ain't even going for man i've got eternal flame ring oh my god you got the place all right brother i'll keep your idea and then thank you ma'am this guy's username is so appropriate <laughs> how did he end up in this lobby of all places stubborn gift and let's go give 1000 total gifts all right where did i need to go oh we need to find egode is this the room we'll give him uh 25 millers Thank you, gamer. I'm very, very grateful. All right, I've actually never lava fish, so uh, hopefully we can uh, catch the ring soon enough. Is the ring rare to get from these things? Apparently, I've seen that it isn't too rare of a drop, but yeah, I'm not too sure. Let me just make sure we have maximum magic find, right? You're all about to see some crazy RNG right now. We've been so lucky this stream. We've been blessed with it. Give me a sea creature. Thank you. Kill that with magic find. And oh my God, chat. Can you believe it? Second sea creature? No way, bro. And this guy apparently has the uh, the king for me as well. There you go, sir. Give me your stank, boy. All right, now we got to bust it over to... Where's water? There's some in the jungle and the mithril deposits, right? I don't think there's any in the precursor city. Oh, hang on. If I go get this crystal, do I lose the stank? Because I'm thinking I may as well get this while I'm here, but I don't know if that means I lose the stank. I don't lose the stinky winky. All right, sweet. I'll take that on my way. Thank you. Oh, there we go. Boom. Smells better. Dude, we've done so well with this now we've done that we can bust it back over to bednam who hopefully should have the last part of the quest for me now once again i had the same recurring nightmare a little different this time i was talking behind the screen again i mentioned a treasure your mom i knew the location of a treasure right under a giant dwarf statue by the right foot of the right dwarf i said but it makes no sense i've never even heard of such treasure there we go that's the final part of the quest by the right foot of the right dwarf do the star court you don't have much time oh yeah i gotta go there real quick as well let's go dude all right, we're in here. We're in here. We got to speak to this guy. He'll give me the hat before it hits 6 a.m., brother. Yes. I want the cult. I'll just join it. I don't even care. Thank you. All right, now we put this thing on. Have I got to go like, um, have I got to go out and come back in? Um, 
have I got to speak to you? You? What's going on? Eager to join our cult? I am. Come to our next meeting in seven days? Bruh. That is a bit of disappointment. Ah, well, we may as well go finish Bednam's quest. 3177 minus 69. Dig here. 3177. <gasps> Yo, that's actually pretty sick. Nightmare. At long last, we got Bednam's quest. All right, we only have a couple of achievements left to do. One of them is the Royal Conversation. Another one is the Empty Flower Pot. And the other is the Aspect of the Jerry. I want to go do the Flower Pot one first. I want to I wanna re-attempt that. Here we are again, old friend. We got the right flower this time. We know to right-click and left-click. It's showing the red particles. All we need to do is do this for five minutes. And I believe... Excuse me? No, no, no. Come on, come on. Give me the achievement at least. Just just give me the achievement real quick. It's not it's not that deep. It's not that deep. We'll get it before we get kicked out for the game update. 100%. No cap. No. Bingo guy at hub? Wait, the bingo guy is already here? Oh, there he is. Event starts in 32 hours. We'll get to get on that pretty soon then. That's actually pretty sick. Well, unfortunately, uh, we can't do that achievement. I'm not going to put myself through that achievement again. Crap ton of leaks. Oh, we got the full gallery, boys. We got the full gallery. You love to see it. So we have upcoming bingo event in 32 hours. Bingo rules. No auction house. No bazaar. No trade and no gem shop. We also have the bingo card. View your bingo card progress for this bingo event, including your personal and community goals. So there's community goals as well, which means we could probably all come together for one challenge that unlocks like a skin or something for everyone. Bingo shop. Spend bingo points on limited time items only obtainable during the bingo event. Upgrade your bingo rank to improve your profile icon and unlock even more shop items. Bingo display. Show off your total bingo points. Collection display. Show off your collection progress. Spawn a statue of Bonzo? Book of stats combined with any weapon in an anvil to start tracking its kills. Eh, that's kind of cool, I guess. Spring boots, feather falling 20, increases how high you can fall before taking fall damage by 20 and reduces fall damage by 100%. Ability to the moon, charge your jump by sneaking. The longer you sneak, the higher you'll jump. That's kind of cool. That's kind of cool, to be fair. I like that. A uh, Dante statue, weirdly. Uh, ditto skull but copies the skull of an unsuspecting player weird bingo talisman and the bingo ring those are all the items then it's something oh actually there's a few more screenshots upgrade bingo rank your rank none upgrades bingo rank one granting you a new profile icon and the ability to purchase more special items from the bingo shop i saw these things had requirements so i don't think there's more getting added just yet cave commodity community goal gain 1 million hearts of the benson experience as a community i guess and uh all contributors get one bingo point and depending on how much you contribute you get more bingo points interesting it's a lot of cosmetic stuff the only thing that's actually useful in there is the bingo ring so i don't know if the bingo is actually fun to play then fair enough but i feel like the shop could do with some more items for sure i'd still love to see like actual like player cosmetics like you know particle effects and stuff like that like you can get in the hubs but maybe it'd be a bit too hectic oh you can actually view all this in game now i can see my bingo card then so these middle ones are the community ones right so for anyone to complete their bingo Bingo card we have to do at least one community event defeat scarf kill 50k sea creatures and then there's these oh on a new profile as well obtain a level 100 pet obtain any backpack so you basically have to like iron man on another profile to do these reach 500 health super compactor seven accessories 50 fairy souls non-cosmetic skill average of seven so just unlock the bazaar it's actually pretty cool this is pretty fun it's basically pigacle's video idea i can't do the rest of the dwarven mines one sadly because they're all time gated now i just have to wait for events or i have to wait for a star court meeting i can't make the aspect of the jerry just out of principle the last one i can do is the royal conversation so yeah i hope ben's ready to edit seven hours of me just right clicking on an npc watching him count down from five thousand. That's going to be very interesting. Here he is. The worst achievement in this entire game. Save the best for last. Oh, man. I'm not ready. Get out of my room now. Oh, does he really take this long between each dialogue as well? I'm actually going to do this but I'm going to do it off camera. Next stream, I'm going to kick it off and I'm going to show you guys evidence that I've actually done this achievement because this is going to suck and I'm not going to put you guys through it. So thank you all so very much for watching. If you enjoyed, please be sure to leave a like and consider subscribing if you're new around here. I'll see you all next time. Please keep me in your thoughts. <laughs>